Guys, what's up and welcome. This is Matthew Singati, the designer and developer. This is my YouTube channel, Core Design, where I teach coding and user interface design. We are continuing with our TypeScript course. Now we have opened Visual Studio Code. Let's just jump straight into it. This is just a Next.js application. Even if you can um, run a pure React uh, application, everything will function well. Let me just show you what I've already done. As you can see, I've just have a simple comp here. This is a page, some sort of a parent component. As you can see, it's consuming sample comp. And this is sample comp and it's rendering sample comp this text. Now let's continue. Let's say inside this sample comp, we don't want to display this string, but we want to display something that has been passed from the parent uh, component. So meaning that the com parent component need to pass a string value to this component and the sample component need to render that value. Can you guess how are we going to do that? Of course, we are going to use props. So what we can do, we can receive a prop here let's say the prop will be title okay this is the prop that we are receiving as you can see now we've got a problem title implicitly has n any type this is typescript telling us that this variable doesn't have a type okay typescript is different from javascript it's catching the errors as we code how can we solve this we need to give a type of string to this title as you can see now in this component typescript is happy but we have a problem as you can see our page tsx which is the parent component is complaining let's just jump there and see what is the problem okay type empty object is not assignable to a type string this is typescript in action typescript is telling us we are receiving a prop which is a string and now we are passing an empty object the reason why you are passing it it says we are passing an empty object is simply because we didn't pass any prop obviously you know in react this is how we pass props title okay sorry okay as you can see title string is not assigned to a type of string also this is typescript telling us that we need to fix our code so let's just go back here and then what we can do we can just open and close curly braces here and then from there we can type this like this okay title and then say this is going to be a string okay as you can see now typescript is happy with this component a sample comp uh, component which is the child component and the parent component we have just passed an empty string okay now in terms of the output there is no difference because we didn't render what we are receiving so let's just recap we are receiving a prop title but we are not using it here okay so let's change this to say rendered title and then we display the prop that we have received okay to display the title that we have received okay so let's pass the title type script let's save let's go back here and then as you can see render title type script so what we have done so far we have passed a prop which is a type of string and then we are rendering it we are receiving it here as a prop and we are typing it telling uh, typescript that this is a string and then we can render that string let's just create a problem because before we end the video to see let's say here inside the title we are rendering a number instead of a string okay let's do it like this 
and then let's render 45. As you can see, TypeScript is telling us that type number is not assignable to a type string. Why this is important? If this was JavaScript, this was going to be okay. This was going to give a problem when we are actually running the code. The main purpose and the main aim for this TypeScript series is to help you to fall in love with TypeScript. I'm Matthew Singati, the designer and developer. See you on the next one.